for this next DIY, you're gonna need a round mirror from Michaels. These gems from, I got these at Walmart. These come in three different sizes. They're big, bigger ones, medium and small. I also got these gems from Michaels. You're gonna need E6000. These are the what, what the gems look like. They have two different sizes. Then I also have these gems. These are square. You're gonna need four of these. Got those from Michaels. You're gonna need your glue sticks, your glue gun, and then I purchased these um, shower curtain rings from the Dollar Tree, and I had my husband cut the ends off. He used uh, nail clippers for dogs from the Dollar Tree. You're gonna need some glitter, Mod Podge, and a brush. Now we're gonna be using these little cubes, the clear cubes, as the legs for the tray. So what you're gonna do is, you're just gonna be using both glues to glue them on properly so that it can have a permanent stay. If you don't want to have a permanent stain, you just want to do a temporary one, you can just use the glue gun. Again, we're going to be mixing it with glitter. And this is going to be for the Chanel rings. But now dry. Now when you're gluing the C's, you want to go ahead and do it this way, this technique that we have so that it can properly dry. So you're going to be adding the glue and then the other one on top. And you're gonna be using a third one, which is gonna be keeping it upright so that it can dry in place. This is what it looks like after they've been glued together and dried. All right, so these are the adhesive gemstones. We're gonna be gluing, um, using both glues. You can really do this way, this part the way that you'd like, but this is how we feel that it came out the best.
back to um wait till this one let me refill it hold on this is what they look like after the diamonds have dried You're also going to want to make sure that the mirror is very clean. So now what we're doing is we're adding glue on the bottom of the uh, C's that we made. And we're going to be gluing it onto the table like this. Don't worry about the glue right now because it's really easy to just peel off when everything is done. We're going to be playing around with the little gemstones right now so that we can know exactly how we want it to be. And then we'll give it a permanent stay. Eventually these will get, be getting glue on too. And again, you don't have to use the permanent glue, you can just use the glue gun for now, but since we want a permanent stay and we want it to permanently look like this, we're gonna be using the, the super glue. What is it called? E6000. E6000. And as you can see, it's already coming out really cute. And you're just gonna wanna repeat that pattern throughout the entire mirror. Well, I'm changing it, put big three, and now I'll go back to big three. Okay, so we're doing two small, one big, three small, and then two small, one big. the tray came out super cute it's a Chanel tray and this is how the table sets gonna be getting decorated for fall as well
think. It's cute. So if you enjoyed my video, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you already haven't. Leave me a comment and let me know if you like my Chanel tray. And also a little bit of decoration. Thank you.